residents living within the Sempe Ousu and Sain Moshizongo communities in the Ashanti region are hardest hit by flooding that washed away one side of the approaches. Uh, filling of uh, the only bridge connecting the two areas. The sub-chief of Sepe, Uswan Nanada Park, fears the situation could wane the academic potentials of the children as they either go to school late or stay at home after every downpour. Residents want the bridge to be fixed to curb the situation. Join us as Mahmoud Muhammad Nuruddin has more. <laughs> That has been the nature of the bridge right from the beginning. It is too small that it can't contain all running water when it rains. Therefore, the water overflows into people's houses. Narrow gully, but now turned into large and deep one. Life becomes measurable here whenever there is torrential rain. This bridge was constructed about 10 years ago to help residents cross each side of the communities. Initially, residents used this bridge to each side of the community, but now one side of the approaches filling has been washed away, so no resident can cross to each side of the community when it rains. <laughs> When it rains, our children can't go to school and we can't also cross to the other side. We want the government to take a second look at the bridge and reconstruct. Located between Sepebokrum and Mosizungo, it poses danger to both children and adults. Several children living within the Sepeusu and Sai in Mosuzungu communities bear the brunt as they struggle to go to school anytime it rains. As you can see, when we experience a downpour, flooding always takes place, which in fact it distracts our attendance of schools, attendance of schools. And the water too, as you know, the water is a water of river, so when the water is flowing, it is contaminated. We can't pass through the water. In fact, if you jog, it will even take you away. Okay, it affected us if you are coming to school. Sometimes, if it rains, it will be flooded. You cannot pass unless we went another way before you can go and cross it. If you the situation is affecting the academic activities of school children. They lament that some of their mates have dropped out of school. Even some even drop out from school due to the water. You miss a lesson when you come late. And also being absent from school also, it's not necessary. Because of this bridge, I have experienced that most of our students have stopped attending this school and they've dropped out to different schools because of being absentee, absenteeism and the rest and the destruction of the water. According to residents, about three people have lost their lives to severe floods. ABS by two, three times. It has even happened before, about two or three times. It always occurs whenever it rains heavily. Nanadapa is a sub chief of Sepe Ousu and Sam. This is now a death trap to children and even adults. We'll take a break on, join on, on the polls and we'll bring you the very latest from the world of sports to stay tuned in.